through time, you will know what it's like to lose. To feel so desperately that you're right, yet to fail all the same. Dread it. Run from it. Destiny still arrives. Y'all the most wicked, profane, disgusting, foul people upon the face of the earth. Right? Yeah, drop dead, you damn devil. Alright? Uh, yeah, we know you mad that you we know you mad that you ain't got no melanin. We know you mad that you can't stand in the sun. We know. Right. Yeah, get scared, cancer, and drop dead, devil. Right. <laughs> the, the punishment of thine iniquity. What? The punishment of thine iniquity. I thought they was getting salvation. The punishment of thine iniquity. But they said they're going to be grafted into the covenant. The punishment of thine iniquity. They said Jesus died for their sins too. The punishment of thine iniquity. According to the Bible, your ass got to get punished, man. That's right. right? Your ass got to, so like, where that sign go? See, the, the wind is stopped, so we can bring that sign on now, right? The Lord said, hey, read that again, Ephraim. Read that again. The punishment of thine iniquity. And the Lord said, the punishment of thine iniquity. Look at this. This is the this they're gonna have to they're gonna have to be punished for their iniquities. Right? And don't y'all know the so-called white man gonna pay for these acts? Right? Don't you know the Lord gonna put the so-called white man in the captivity right. for what they did to our people? That's right! Look, look at this brother. This brother got a damn muzzle on his neck like he a damn dog. Right? So these people gonna have to pay for this, man. These people gonna have to pay for selling us on auction blocks, right? These people gonna have to pay for kidnapping our people and putting us on slave ships, That's right. right? You hear that? You hear that, Timmy? You hear that? You hear that, uh, Becky and, and, and aggression? Y'all hear that? Emily. Right? Right? These people gonna have to pay for that, man. Right? So we don't. The punishment of thine iniquity is accomplished. O oh, daughter of Zion, right. he will no more carry thee away into captivity. Right. He will visit thine iniquity, O oh, daughter of Edom. What? O oh, daughter of Edom. Right, so, O oh, daughter of Edom, man, the Most High God is going to visit their iniquity by uh, thermonuclear uh, missiles, man. Right. 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 We can't wait till the Lord to send that those, those missiles, man, and blow up this wicked ass kingdom, man. Right. Where I had you at, King? Uh, Matthew 15 7. This is the book of Matthew, chapter 15, verse 7. Ye hypocrites. Ye what? Ye hypocrites. What are all people? Ye hypocrites. This is so called black man. Ye hypocrites. This is so called Hispanic. Ye hypocrites. About the Native American. Ye hypocrites. You know what Ye hypocrites. We don't. Well, did Esaias prophesy of you, saying, These people draweth. High unto me with their mouth. The Lord said, Our people draw not unto him with their mouth. Right? Like that sister said, she said, I said, Sister, you love God? She said, All day. Right? So if you love God, why are you walking hand in hand with the same people that, that put your people in captivity? Right? Why are you walking hand in hand with the same people that painted Joe Lord and Savior as a so called white man? Right. That painted our God as a so-called white man. Bring it out. That painted all our kings, our priests, and our prophets as so-called white men. Right. Right? We don't. And honoreth me with their lips. With their heart. What do they do what? With the honoreth me with their lips. What is that brother doing? And honoreth me with their lips. You can't make this sound about Jesus. He sound like the Christian pastor, man. <laughs> These people honor the Lord and our Lord and Savior with their lips. That's all our people know how to do. Jesus! Right? <laughs> our people are destroyed, man. That's how you know this Bible is talking about our people. <laughs> this is madness, man. Read on. But their heart is far from me. For the Lord said our minds is far from him, man. The Lord has smitten our people with madness. Right? 
Read that again from the top. This is the book of Matthew, chapter 15, verse 8. These people draweth nigh unto me with their mouth, and honoreth me with their lips. And do what? And honoreth me with their lips. What does that brother do? And honoreth me with their lips. Hey, we're going to ask y'all again. Do y'all beautiful sisters have a minute for the words of God? Nope. Uh, well, y'all got to repent. Put on my prayer, all right? Put some clothes on, all right? The Lord said y'all got to cover up and put some clothes on, all right? So if y'all love God, you're going to cover yourself up, all right? All right. See that? Our people are wicked, man. <sighs> Madness, man. But their heart is far from me. What do you want to say about that, brother? But their heart is far from me. What about those sisters? But their heart is far from me. And our hearts are far from the Lord, man. Right? The Lord me. What's your ethnicity? If you're a so-called white girl, the Lord don't love you. That's right. If you're a so-called white girl, the Lord gonna put your wicked ass to death. That's right. Alright? Alright? Yeah, this is, this is madness, man. You know. Verse 9. But in vain, they do worship me. They do what? But in vain, they do worship me. And this is vanity, man. Taking your damn shirt off and screaming, Jesus is not true to worship the Lord. The Lord said, if you love me, you're going to keep my commandments. Right? I mean, our people got all types of spirits on them, man. We have to pray for our people. Right? <laughs> Read on. Teaching. And our, our people, and, and this is this is embarrassing, man. Our people are the laughing stock of the earth, man. Laughing stock. All these other nations laugh at our people. The Lord put our people at a low state. Right? The Lord has has reduced the kings of the earth into nothing, man. Right? Read on. Teaching for doctrines, the commandments of men. The what? The commandments of men. What is taking your shirt off and screaming, Jesus? The commandments of men. And these are the commandments of men, man. This is what they teach you in the Christian church, man. This is a damn shame, man. Right? That don't make no damn sense, man. Let me get Hosea, let me get Hosea 4 and 1. Let me get Hosea 4 and 1. Right? <laughs> let me get that Hosea 4 and 1, man. Let me get uh Hosea 6 and 1. Right? <sighs> read, read that. The book of Hosea, chapter 4, verse 1. Hear the word of the Lord. What? Hear the word of the Lord. What? Ye children of Israel. Ye what? Ye children of Israel. Ye everybody. Ye children of Israel. The Lord is only for the children of Israel, man. So you so-called blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans need to wake up and come back to your heads. Wake up! Right? Come back to your true nationality. Separate from your damn slave master. Right. Right? And come back and repent and return it to the Lord your God. Right. We don't. For the Lord has a controversy. The Lord have a what? For the Lord has a controversy. The Lord love everybody. For the Lord has a controversy. The Lord said he has a controversy. So the Lord is angry with the sinful, wicked kingdom. Read on. With the inhabitants of the land. With the what? With the inhabitants of the land. Because there is no truth. There is no what? There is no truth. And we all know according to the Bible, the truth is the laws of God. So the laws of God are not practiced in this wicked land. That's right. Right? We got all type of homosexuality. People that yeah, yo, yo, red neck ass going to captivity, all right? So drop dead, Billy. I don't know about you, Mr. Israelite, sir, but I'm a preacher. And I'm ready to die for this. If you ain't ready to die for this, get out of here. Hey, brother, hey, watch what you say, brother, because the Lord can strike you down, brother. get out of <laughs> this is madness, man. Get people are destroyed, man. We don't, we don't. Oh my God! Our people got spirits on the man. Our people got spirits on the man. Hey, brother, we can't, brother. Because there is no truth, nor mercy, nor knowledge of God. Or what? Nor knowledge of God. This is brother, don't got. Brother, you ain't got the knowledge of God. Repent, brother. We got legions and demons on you. Right? Repent, brother. That's right. We don't. No 
more knowledge of God in the land. Right, let me get the book of Matthew chapter 12 and verse uh, 28. Let me get Matthew 12 and 28. Bring it up. Read what you got. God, Hosea 6 and 1. You got that, Matthew? Uh, got it. All right, bring that up. The book of Matthew, chapter 12, verse 28. This is mad. Hey, get this on camera, sir. This is, mad. this is madness, man. Oh, man. <laughs> I mean, this is sad, man. I mean, I'm trying not to laugh, but, but this is painful, man. Read on. But if I cast out devils, but if I do what? But if I cast out devils, who's trying to do this, brother? But if I cast out devils, who's trying to do this, brother? If I cast out hey, brother, we're trying to cast out your damn devil. Right. Get that devil out of you, brother. Yeah. Repent and come back to the commandments. Right? Our people have to repent, man. Right? Who verse you at, brother? All right, let me, let me get uh, verse 38. Then certain of the scribes and the Pharisees answered, saying, Master, we would see a sign from thee. We would do what? We will see a sign from thee. You want to see a sign from the Lord, man. We want the Lord to, to get this demon off of our brother, man. What? Yeah, I got a demon. Brother, you gotta you gotta get out the damn street, brother. That don't make no damn sense, man. The Lord said every idle word that man shall speak, they're gonna give account in the day of judgment, man. That brother gotta repent, man. Brother, you gotta repent, brother. <laughs> Read what you got. This is the book of Hosea. Let me, let me do Psalm 107 and 19. This is the book of Hosea, chapter 6, verse 1. Come and let us return unto the Lord. Come and let us do what? Come and let us return unto the Lord. Let us do a hand in hand with our pastor. Come and let us return unto the Lord. Let us vote for the next president. Come and let us return unto the Lord. Well, the Lord is telling his so-called blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans to come and return unto the Lord. Right. Right. You know? For he has torn. For the Lord did what? For he has torn. What did the Lord do to his brother? For he has torn. And the Lord has torn your spirit, brother. And we're trying to put you back together with the words of God, brother. You got to repent, brother. You got to get that spirit off you, brother. The Lord has smitten you with madness, brother. Right. We don't. And he will heal us. He will do what? And he will heal us. You want the Lord to do this, brother? And he will heal us. Oh, the brother, we want the Lord to heal you, man. Right. right? We want the Lord to get all these dead devils and these spirits off you, brother. We want you on our side preaching the words of God, brother. We want you on our side trying to wake up the lost sheep of the house of Israel. Get out! And he had smitten. He had been what? And he has smitten. What did the Lord do to his brother? He has smitten. And brother, the Lord has smitten you, man. But you gotta wake up. You gotta repent, brother. We don't. And he will bind us up. He will do what? And he will bind us up. Hey, brother, the Lord has binded us up, man. Right. And we want the Lord to bind you up too, brother. Right? We are a laughing stock to the world, man. We are a laughing stock to all these other nations, man. Bring it out. Right? We tied up in the scum of the earth, man. We want the Lord to put his back on those where he's supposed to be at, man. Right? right? We don't. And, and, and look at this damn devil. All praises to the most high, man. That's right. And Becky the fill in the damn say, Get that on camera, man. And oh, hey, hey, get hit by a car, Becky. That's right. Right? We hope you drop dead, Becky. <laughs> All praises, man. Damn devil fill in the damn street, man. All praises. Come down and sit your crusty, pale face ass in the damn dust. Right. Verse 2. After two days, will he revive us? Will he do what? After two days, will he revive us? Hey, brother, hey, brother, you got you got to separate from your enemy. You got to separate from your oppressor, brother. And in the third day, he will raise us up. He will do what? In the third day, he will raise us up. What the Lord going to do to his race? He will raise us up. We want the Lord to raise us up out of the graves, man. Right. This brother is in the spiritual grave. We want the Lord to raise us back up to be the keys of peace upon the face of the earth, man. Why we don't? And we shall live. And we shall what? And we shall live. We shall what? And we shall live. We want to be alive again, man. Our people are spiritually dead. Right. Our people are mentally dead, man. Right? The so-called white man has destroyed the minds of our people. Right? Right? We don't. And we shall live in his sight. And we shall do what? And we shall live in his sight. You want to live in the sight of the Lord again, man. Right? 
We want to rule over cities, man. We want to have power, rulership, and dominion over all these other nations, man. Right. Right. We know. Then shall we know if we follow on, on to know the Lord. His, his going forth is prepared as the morning. And he shall come. He shall do what? And he shall come. He shall do what? And he shall come unto us as the rain, as the latter, and the former rain unto the earth. O Ephraim, O who? O Ephraim, what shall I do unto thee? O Judah, what shall I do unto thee? For the Lord said, O Ephraim, right? The Lord is calling you so called Hispanics and Native Americans to come back. The Lord is calling you so called African Americans and you so called Negroes to come back. Right? And return back to your heritage. Return back to these laws, statutes, and commandments. Right. Right? That's it on that. Can you read what you got? And let me get Hosea 14 and 1. And then I'm going to get Matthew 4 17. We're going to close it up. Read it. 107 19. The book of Psalms, chapter 107, verse 19. Then they cry unto the Lord. And they do what? Then they cry unto the Lord. We're crying into the Lord right now, man. We're crying into the Holy by Shimmy Abishai right now, man. We're crying to ask that the Lord revive our people. Heal our people. Because our people are in a lower state, man. Right. Our people are being destroyed every single day by the hands of these wicked, foul, disgusted bastards, man. Right? That continue to shoot our people down in the damn street, man. Right? Hey, sis, you got a minute for the words of God? All right, now, you got to repent. Put on my Shapiro, all right? All right, put some clothes on, sister, all right? We love you, sister. All right, we love you, sister, all right? We love you, sister. We repent. Come back to the commandment, sister. Right? I feel, what the, we just read in Matthew. The Lord said these people drive nigh to me with their mouth, man. Our people all about lip service. Our people all about running their damn mouth, but they don't want to do a damn thing that the Lord tell them to do. We don't. Then they cry unto the Lord in their trouble. In their what? In their trouble. You so-called blessed Spanish and Native Americans haven't realized by now their ass is in trouble, man. Their ass has been oppressed every single damn day, man. Getting shot down every single damn day, man. Our kids are being kidnapped every single damn day, man. We are gonna come back to the Lord. We are gonna repent. We are gonna separate from your damn oppressor. All right. We don't. Then they cry unto the Lord in their trouble, right. and He saveth them. And he do what? And He saveth them. We want the Lord to do. And he saveth them. We want the Lord to save our people, man. We want the Lord to save that brother, man. That brother got legions of demons on him, man. We want the Lord to revive our people and pick us back to a higher state. We don't. He saveth. He saveth them out of their distresses. He sent his word. He did what? He sent his word. He sent the white man. He sent his word. He sent the Christian church. He sent his word. He sent the stimulus check. He sent his word. And the Lord said he's trying to send his word to the so-called blessed Spanish and Native Americans. We don't. He sent his word and healed them. And did what? And healed them. And did what? And healed them. We want the Lord to heal our people, man. We want the Lord to heal that brother, man. Right? We're tired of being out of lower state, man. We're tired of being oppressing this wicked kingdom, man. Right? Read on. And deliver them from their destruction. Oh, that men would praise the Lord. Oh, that what? Oh, that men would praise the Lord. Call him on Yahweh by Shimei Awashah, man. Right? The words and the prophecies of the Most High God has been fulfilled every single day, man. So it's time for you so-called black Hispanics and Native Americans to wake up. Before your ass get put to death in these last days, man. The Most High God is sending earthquakes. The Most High God is sending hurricanes. The Most High God is sending mass shooters. To put people to death that don't repent in these last days. Read what you got, King. Let me get Matthew 4, 17. That's going to be it for me. This the book, this the book of Hosea, chapter 14, verse 1. Oh, oh Israel. Oh, who? Oh, Israel. Oh, everybody. Oh, Israel. You say, oh, Israel. You so-called black Hispanics and Native Americans. We return unto the Lord thy God. Be a homosexual. Return unto the Lord thy God. Celebrate New Year. Return unto the Lord thy God. Walk your hand in hand with your damn enemy. Return unto the Lord thy God. It's time for you so-called blessed Spanish and Native Americans to return unto the Lord your God. Read on. 
For thou hast fallen. We have been hurt. For thou hast fallen. How about people do? For thou hast fallen. Our people have fallen, man. All right? Our people got to repent, come back to the commandments before it's too late. We know. By thine iniquity, take with you your words and turn to the Lord. And do what? And turn to the Lord. And do what? And turn to the Lord. It's time for the so called blessed Spanish and Native Americans to stop being simple and return to the Lord your God. Right? We need to get ready for war in these last days. Why you simple ass Negroes sitting on the couch playing 2K, smoking a damn blunt? The so called white man is teaching his kids how to shoot guns. Right? He's teaching his kids how to kill and hunt down you damn niggas. Right? So you simple Negroes and you simple Latinos need to get ready for war. Be what you got and that's gonna be it for me. The book of Matthew, chapter 4, verse 17. From that time, Yahweh Shah began to preach and to say, Repent, do what? Repent, do what? Repent for the kingdom. For the what? For the kingdom. For the what? For the kingdom of heaven is at hand. Is that what? Is at hand. Is that what? Is at hand. That's why we tell you, week in and week out, the kingdom of heaven is at hand for so called blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans. If you didn't know you're living in the last days, and if you want to escape the death, destruction, the famine, and the pestilence that's coming to the earth. You gotta come back to the Lord. You gotta repent. And you gotta keep his law, statutes, and commandments, man. But with that, we want to give all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh by Shimei Harushah and Shalom. Come on, Shalom! Come on, Shalom! Come on, Shalom!